Hoy sí. Hoy sí. Compañeros castrosos también. Hello, hello, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. How are you doing today? Hello, good evening. Good evening, good evening. How are good you? Good evening, good evening. Good evening. I'm are fine. you ready? Teacher. Are you ready for your English class? Yes, I'm ready. I'm ready. Yes, I'm ready. All right, excellent, excellent. How was your day? I'm fine, thank you, sir. What did you do today? What did you do today? I went to the supermarket, teacher. Oh, grocery shopping. <laughs> mm -hmm. And, what, And did I, you, what did you buy? Uh, comida. <laughs> How do you say comida? Uh, no. How do you say comida? Uh, food. 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 Thank you, thank you. <laughs> That's right. Okay. That's right. You did food. Okay. Well, I had to clean and, my house. And I had to prepare dinner. Oh, okay. All right. So you cook? You can cook? Yes, I am cook. You can cook or you can uh, yeah. cook? La <laughs> dos. <laughs> ah, I do prepare pupusas. <laughs> oh, really? You can cook pupusas? Yeah. Oh, wow. Delicious. Okay. All right. That's good. That's <laughs> good. Um, I I had a girlfriend a long time ago. And uh, I remember one day she told me, I'm going to cook for you. So I was like, oh, okay, sounds good. And then she came to my house <laughs> and she brought some fish, fish filet. And poor girl, oh my God. When I saw her, I said, hey, you know what? Leave it alone. We're going to call. We're going to order some food. <laughs> Leave it alone. You know, because... <laughs> She, you know, she, she did. She did it out of the goodness of her heart. You know, I understand, but she could not cook. She couldn't cook. She, <laughs> she wanted to. She, she had the desire in her heart, but eh. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> yeah, that's why I said, "Can you cook or can you cook?" You know. <laughs> yeah. No, okay. I have met. I have met some women. That can cook. Um, I used to have, my, well, my baby mama, one of my baby mamas. I have a baby mama in the United States. Um, I have a son over there. And that girl, she could cook. I can take my hat off and put my hands on the fire. And I say that girl can cook. Yeah. Yeah. I It's remember. very nice. Yeah, yeah, she could cook. She could cook. I remember. I remember. We used to live together, but now she's in the United States. Yeah. Somebody else is with her. But that girl, she could cook. Really, really. Like you can you can have tortillas, salt, lemon, and whatever. And she will make eggs. And she will make a feast, delicious. I was like, "What? Your imagination, you know? Her her imagination was incredible in the kitchen." So yeah, somebody, some people, they have a, a natural talent for that. Me, that is not my talent. My talent is business, but the kitchen is not my talent. I survive. Mm -hmm. I survive. I don't die of hunger. I survive, but that's not, <laughs> that's not my talent. That's not my talent. 
<laughs> okay. Sure. Yeah, yeah. All right, guys. Welcome, everybody. I hope that you all are feeling excellent. I feel, I hope that you feel great. Um, today is Thursday, so today we're going to finish uh, Section 3, and hopefully we can finish the midterm exam because next week on Monday, we are going to start uh, Section 4 and finish the final exam. So right now, what I would like for you to do is I would like for you to tell me uh, what vocabulary or what do you remember from yesterday's class? What was the topic? What did we talk about? What do you remember? Quantifiers. Quantif how many, how much? How many, how much? That's right. A lot, a few, a little, any, and none. Yeah. Uh, and none, that's right. So right now, what I would like for us to do is we're going to look at some examples. Can somebody give me an example uh, using a lot? One example using a lot. Somebody give me an example using a lot. I had a lot hungry. I have a lot hungry. Mm. In this case, you're going to say, I am very hungry. I am very hungry. I am very hungry. A lot is used with countable nouns or uncountable nouns. In this case, there is no noun. Uh, you can say... I want a lot of food, non-countable, or you can say, I want a lot of pupusas, countable. But if you want to say, tengo mucha hambre, you don't use a lot. A lot is for quantifiers, like... Uh, Maybe a lot of people, a lot of places. But if you're talking about your feelings, right? Or you want to say, tengo mucho sueño. You can say, I am very sleepy. All right. Oh, quieres decir, estoy muy feliz. I am very happy. So if you want to express your, your feelings, your emotions, we use very. Uh -huh. Okay, can somebody give me an example with a few? A few, an example a with- few, um, A few of my friends live in San Salvador. Excellent. A few of- my friends live in San Salvador. Excellent. Very good. Uh, somebody give me an example with a little. A little. I put a little, a little sugar in my coffee. I put a little sugar in my coffee excellent coffee. excellent okay all right it looks like you guys understand this topic um do you guys have any questions referring this information okay teacher ex Hi. exactamente que, sin que significa a few a few a few significa pocos pocos Tú dices, okay. pocos de mis amigos viven en San Salvador. Uh, mm -hmm. okay. A few of my friends live in San Salvador. Yo siento que cada día es más caro vivir en San Salvador. Creo que voy a buscar un lugar así como en, en Suchitoto, 
on some sonata or something because San Salvador is very expensive. I went to a uh, Mayaque, it's a pupuseria near my neighborhood. One pupusa, one dollar and ten cents. One pupusa. I was like, good Lord, too much money. Uh, another question. Another question. Okay. Let's move forward, and we're going to be looking at the next activity, which is knowledge check 3.9, knowledge check 3.9. Instructions. Instructions. On the spaces provided for each sentence, write the proper quantifier. Pay attention if it is a countable and or non-countable noun. Instructions. En los espacios en blanco, Escriba lo, el cuantificador. Correcto. Ponga atención si el sustantivo es contable o no contable. Uh, did everybody finish this activity? Yes, teacher. Everybody? Yes, yes. Yes, yes teacher. Yes. All right. Everybody did it. Yes, teacher. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and check together. I would like for you to open your platform and we are going to check the activity together. Let's check it out. Uh, the first one, number one, one volunteer. Number one, one volunteer. There is much, much, much. Noise. Okay, okay. There is much noise. Because noise is non-countable, right? Yeah. Ruido, noise, uncountable. All right, number two. There are many, 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 many restaurants. There are many restaurants. There are many restaurants, oh, right? Oh. You got Papa John's, Domino's Pizza, Buffalo Wings, Kung Fu Panda, I mean, Kung Fu Express. Uh, China Walk, <laughs> many restaurants. Uh, number three, there is much, 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 much or much. much. What is the correct much, pronunciation? Much, 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 correct, much, much, correct, much, much. The the spelling is U, but the pronunciation is A. Much, 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 much. There is much, much crime. <clears throat> Why? Because crime is considered uncountable, right? You can't count crime. Uh, number four, there is much, 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 much traffic, traffic. Much, much traffic. There are many, many apartments buildings. Many apartment many. buildings many apartment buildings is correct build no no buildings no B. building 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 okay the next part for these exercises choose between a few a little a little Por estos ejercicios, para estos ejercicios, escoja entre a few and a little. Yes. ¿Quieren saber algo de mí? Yes. Yes. A little. <laughs> eh, yo nunca estudié a leer español ni a escribir español. Yo aprendí español uh, con mis abuelos. Pero wow. mi, mi estudio académico, todo fue en inglés. Mm. Uh -huh. wow. uh -huh. right. It's very interesting. Yeah, yeah, it's crazy porque yo de repente empecé a leer en español, escribir en español. And where do you start, coach? Uh, I started in Houston, Texas. Oh. And I went to the university in San Antonio, Texas. Wow. Uh -huh. Yeah, business administration. administration. I imagine. Ah. You imagine, imagine it? Yeah. It's because you accent is no Salvadorian. Yeah. No, uh, <laughs> por eso cuando leo, trato de pronunciar 
lo mejor que puedo y tratar de pronunciar lo perfecto, right? Because eh, no tuve estudio formal, pero lo entiendo, lo es, lo, lo, yo creo que lo puedo eh, eh, tal vez enseñar eh, porque sé las reglas gramaticales en inglés, pero el, el español les dicen que es más, es más complicado que el inglés. Ajá, así que si me escucha decir una palabra mal, no es a, no es a propósito. ¿Ah? Eh, because uh, I live in, ¿Cuál fue el motivo por el cual usted se vino o vive acá en Escocia? Ah, ok. Ahí sería why, because no. No, sería why. Ah, ahí sería why. Debemos decir, why do you live in El Salvador? Why do you live in El Salvador? Uh -huh. Y después tú respondes, I live in El Salvador. Y ahí sí usamos el because. I live in El Salvador because... I live in El Salvador because it's a beautiful country. O sea, I live in El Salvador, but I work in the United States. I work in uh, real estate. Do you know what is real estate? Yes, sir. Hi. Excuse me. Hi. May you, may you tell us the reason for you coming? Yes, uh, I was in the army. I was yes. in the US Army. Do you know the army? Live, live, yeah, yeah. live, right, live, live. Ejército. Yes, I was in the US Army and they wanted me to go to I wreck for the war. Wow. And I said, uh, El Salvador. <laughs> so I came to El Salvador. I, I didn't want to go die. Uh, I don't know if you remember. Uh, back in 2004, 2005, somewhere around that time uh, in Iraq, it was terrible. It was terrible. A lot of soldiers were getting killed, uh, especially Latinos and African American. And they wanted me to go over there to the war and I was in the university, you know, the, the, my, my university, the military pay for my university. I was in a scholarship program because I didn't have a lot of money. You know, the university in the United States is very expensive. But when they said, hey, you gotta go to the war, to Iraq. And I was like, hey, I need to say goodbye to my family. And they said, okay, you can go. And then I went to Houston to my family. And I told my father, I said, hey, they want to send me to Iraq. I'm going to El Salvador. <laughs> so I have been living here uh, for about 10 years. And I, I work in real estate in the United States. Online. Okay. Oh, your history is very interesting, coach. Yeah, <laughs> it's very interesting, but, but very sad. <laughs> well, honestly, honestly, uh, I think that God has a, a purpose for everything because I am a happy man. I, I have two good jobs. Uh, 
I enjoy my life. I love El Salvador. I love El Salvador weather, the mountains, the volcanoes, the beaches, the lakes, the rivers, the fruit, the food, the people, the culture. Believe me, believe me, El Salvador is 10 times better than the United States. Over there, it's, all, the, it's plastic, what, no what love, about, artificial. What really? What about the road of, the road of Salvador? What about what? The street, the road. The streets? No. The, Sí, sí, las calles, ¿qué puede decir? No, de las calles de El Salvador. Ah, the streets. Ah, the transportation. Yeah. It's different. The, the streets here are more narrow. And the transportation system is to the right, to the right, to the right. So you have to yeah. get, uh, get used to it. But uh, El Salvador, for me, in my personal opinion, is better than Houston or than Texas. Uh, because over here, yeah. people, you know, I noticed that people are more human. People are more, more sincere. Uh, in the United States, people are more artificial, materialistic. You know, if you don't have $100 shoes, um, if you don't have a $10,000 car, it's like you are nothing, you know? They don't care. It's all money, money. It's a, it's a plastic culture. It's a fake society. It, it, to live, I, I prefer El Salvador. You know, here in El Salvador, if I go to the store in the corner and I say, hey, give me a beer. And then another guy comes and he buys a beer and we start talking and we become friends and we share ideas and we socialize you know and you build a friendship in the u.s it's like i don't know you who are you you're not my friend it's 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 different is people are more cold you know yeah or, or for example, if you are in the super and you say, oh, I need a dollar. What am I going to do? I need a dollar. You know, people will be like, hey, here's a dollar, man. Go ahead. In the United States, oh, look at him. He's so poor. And nobody will help you. So it's a, it's a different culture. I mean, I personally, I prefer to live here. Okay. And now it's better. Now I can go to, I live near Redonde La Chulona. So after class, I can go to Salvador del Mundo. I can go to La Chulona and I can walk at night with two cell phones in my hands, no problem. And like this, on two cell phones, like this, no problem. You know? So, it's nice. I can go to the beach, 40 minutes. I can go to the volcano, 20 minutes. I can go to the lake, 30 minutes. It's better. My country is better. Mm -hmm. It's a, I love El Salvador. It's better, honestly. I had already heard that. Yeah. Because you know, my, uh -huh. because my friend live in Texas. Ah. Okay. And she says it's horrible. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Texas is yeah. bad, and and not only that, you know. Uh, here in El Salvador, I had never, I had never eaten pocotes. I had never eaten lichas. I had never eaten um, um, mamones. I had never eaten 
Mangos. No, mangos, mangos they have in 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 Texas because guindas. Of, ah guindas I had never had guindas I had Nancy. never nances I had never had nances I had never mm -hmm. had uh, I mean el, Sal, el, el Salvador is so rich in fruit you know where I live where I live in front of my door there is a marañón japonés tree. And then next to that tree is a avocado tree. And then over here on this side, there is a mango tree, you know? So when I call with my brother or my sister in, in Houston or California, they, they are amazed because I show them, look, look, brother, look, sister, this is a marañón tree. Look, look at the fruit, it's red. Look, those are mangoes right there, real mangoes. That's an avocado, real, not genetic mangoes, genetic avocados, genetic uh, marañón, real, natural, organic. They're like, or, or what is the color of the, the mojonchos, the, um, the banana, the mojonchos, right? I, we have mojonchos bananas here. I can open my door and get mango, get a marañón, get a mojoncho. You will never see that. Never in the United States. Never. Yes. That doesn't exist. It's crazy. That's why I yeah. love this tropical paradise. <laughs> All right, let's continue, guys. There is Later. a little, little there little. is a little pollution. A little pollution. There is a little pollution. Uh, there are a few, a few shopping, centers. shopping centers. A few shopping centers. There are a few schools in this neighbor. A few schools in this neighborhood. There is. A little, a, little a, little little a little traffic. There are a few, a few traffic lights in the city. A few traffic lights in the city. Oh, that's another, that's another thing. Here in El Salvador, if you turn off the lights, you can see the stars. In Texas, you can't. Because it's so much uh, air contamination, air pollution, you know, and there's so much uh, light, light pollution over there because of the electricity. Here, I open my window, beautiful stars, full of stars. It's a different, uh, it's a different view. Uh, number one, uh, there. Aren't any taxis in this part of town? Number two, there isn't any traffic. Isn't any traffic. Number three, there isn't any there isn't any public transportation after 9 p.m. Number four. All right, honey. All right. There aren't any parking spaces. Any parking spaces. There. Isn't, isn't any, any crime. crime. Isn't any crime. crime. All right. Uh, at this moment, does anybody have any questions in regards to this information? Questions? Questions, questions? All right. Let's go ahead and take a look at the next one. In this session, participants will have a chance to read 
an article from a magazine, develop skills in scanning and reading for details. En esta clase, los participantes leerán un artículo de una revista para desarrollar habilidades de análisis de lectura. The world in one neighborhood. Let's read together. Let me have one volunteer. Jenny, number one, please. Hey, teacher. Uh, tell me, please, what the pronunciation of sidewalks? Sidewalks. 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 Okay. sidewalks. The sidewalks are crowded. I see, teacher. Crowded, crowded. Uh, white Indian women in colorful traditional dress. Okay. Aquí sería women. 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 In colorful traditional Give me one second. Dress. One minute. One minute. Hold on just a second. Uh, we say W-O-M-A-N, singular. W-O-M-E-N, plural. Repeat. Woman. 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 And women. 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 Woman. Woman. Women. Women. Right. So this one is singular. And this one is plural. Repeat one more time. Woman. 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 Women. 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 No, women. Como we. Women. Se escribe con O, pero se pronuncia así. We. Women. 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 Very good. Women. Okay, continue. Uh, <clears throat> a women on corner is sailing. Sailing? Oh. Chinese mm -hmm. cats. A new song for a Romanian. That band is playing in a restaurant is it indian china Romania? no it's astoria a neighborhood in queens new york new york city astoria was on a mostly greek neighborhood but the area is changing teacher is changing is changing. Changing fast. A new residents from India, Pakistan, Thailand, China, and all over the United States are moving in. They forgot El Salvador. <laughs> 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 because there's a lot of Salvadorians in New York, in Texas, California. It's a lot of Salvadorians. Chicago, a lot of Salvadorians. Florida, a lot of Salvadorians. All right, number two, select somebody. Jenny. Jorge. George. Okay, thank you. Number two, George. The new residents bring many traditions. This tradition blends together to make story. story. Multicultural, when people are surrounded by different cultures, they adopt the thing that they like. There is one resident hearing a story. It isn't surprising that an Indian woman, woman buys Mexican tortillas from a Korean grocery store. It's one of the things that makes the neighborhood special. You know what this uh, reminds me of? Do you know what this reminds me of? George? Let me see the check. I don't know. Select somebody, George. Okay. Who? Who do you select? Alba Lutica. Alba, oh no, 
Albaluz, let me see. Yes. Hey, Albaluz, okay, Albaluz, number three. It isn't surprising that a story in the way surprising. Become, in, it isn't surprising that a story is becoming a very popular place to live. The rents are reasonable. 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 The neighborhood is safe and it has very good public transportation. There are expensive stores, many nice restaurants, and good fresh fruit, fruit and vegetables. Fruit. Fruit. Fruit and vegetable markets. Vegetables. 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 Vegetables market. And Astoria is a comfortable place to live. Apartments are usually big and roomy. As one long time residents say, why live? Anywhere else, Astoria has it all. Repeat, else, 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 else. 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 Why lie anywhere else? Uh -huh. uh, do you know what this article reminds me of? Uh, when I was a little boy, I lived with my grandmother and my grandfather in Houston, and we lived in some apartments in a poor neighborhood and the apartments were like this right right here it was like this right one apartment here one apartment here one apartment here and one apartment here so on christmas it was crazy because here was my family and we were salvadorian over here was another family. They were from Vietnam. From Vietnam. Uh, over here was another family. Uh, they were from Africa. But Africa, Africa. Not American Africa. Africa, Chaka Zulu, Zimbabwe, Nigeria. Really, really African family from Africa with, with blue black is skin uh, over here was a mexican a mexican family so on christmas uh, it was crazy because on christmas you can hear over here uh, cumbias merengue uh, over here chinese music over here african music uh, over here, banda music. So it was like a, a combination of different uh, cultures, different races, uh, people from different parts of the world. It was very interesting. I remember uh, as a little boy, uh, to me, it was very normal when I was going to school. Uh, in front of me was... Uh, Indian, a Hindu from India. And behind me was uh, maybe somebody from Russia. And next to me, maybe somebody from Mexico or Peru, right? So in kinder, I remember in kindergarten, uh, you had children different colors, uh, black, yellow, white, uh, my teachers, they used to think that I was African. And they used to they used to think I was a black. And they they used to say, Can you understand what I say? No. Yes, I, I understand perfectly what, what you're telling me. <laughs> you know, and they, they were surprised. And they were like, Where are you from? They used to think that I was black. And I say, I used to say, no, I, I am Salvadorian. Where, what part of Mexico is El Salvador? Is no, it's not, it's not Mexico, it's Central America. Where is that? You know, a lot of people 
it, at that time, you're talking about the, the 80s, they didn't really know about El Salvador. So that's, you know, that's something different uh, about the United States. You have an opportunity to learn uh, about different cultures, different customs. I think that's pretty cool. All right. Any questions about the vocabulary here in this conversation? Questions about the vocabulary here? Multicultural. Oh, multicultural. 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 Okay, guys, I got to take the attendance. It's already 8.40. Uh, when I call your name, please say present. Uh, Alba Luz? Present. Present. Very good. Today is... Soy yo o el tiempo va volando. Ana Yamila. Present teacher. Excellent. Blanca Guadalupe. Blanca. In the Blanca. chat. Ah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I remember she said she was going to be a listener. Okay. The next one is Carlos Ernesto. Carlos Ernesto. Absent. Cristina Claribel. Present. Present. Edma Azalia. Present teacher. All right. Edwin Alexander. Present teacher. Okay. Efraín Emilio. Efraín Emilio. In the chat, in the chat, the sun. In the sun chat, teacher. Right. Okay, there it is. Uh, Fatima Elisa. Absent. Fatima Noemi. Fatima. Herbert Eliseo. Herbert Eliseo. Present in the, in the chat. In the sunshine wrote. Okay. Oh, Fatima Elisa is present. Oh, okay. Fatima Elisa. Okay. Okay. I didn't see that. Sorry. Okay. Fatima Elisa present. Fatima Noemi present. Herbert Eliseo present. Herbert, Heber, Eliseo. Heber, Eliseo, Bojorque. He writes in the chat the Zoom. Oh. Okay. Isaura, Evelia. Present teacher. Josia Alexiomar. Present teacher. Right. Jonathan Josue. George Alberto. Present teacher. Okay. Jose Enrique Oriana. Present teacher. All right. Jose Luis Castro. Jose Luis Castro. His absence. Okay. Maria Elizabeth. 
Present teacher. All right. Nelson Adán. Nelson Adán. In the swing chat. Okay, present. Norma Callejas. Present. Norma Lizano. Present teacher. Okay. Nubia Cristina. Present teacher. All right. Oscar Alexander. Present teacher. Okay. Silvia Lisette. Present teacher. Okay. Susanna Isabel. Present. Okay. Yancy Melanie. Present. Very good. Yenny Carolina. Present teacher. All right. And Yoseling Yvette. Jocelyn Yvette. Okay, absent. Absent. Okay. All right, guys. Uh, we're going to go ahead and move forward. And I would like for us to Take a look at the exercise and we are going to check this activity um, who can tell me what are the points there are six what is the first one inexpensive inexpensive stores inexpensive stores big big apartments big apartments big apartments great, great, great market Great markets. Nice restaurants. Nice restaurants. Many different cultures. Many different cultures. Good public transportation. All right. All right. At this moment, we're going to go ahead and uh, move forward to the midterm exam. ¿Quiénes ya hicieron el midterm exam? ¿O quiénes no lo han hecho? A mí me hacen falta las últimas dos partes. Okay, okay. Very good, Jenny. Thank you. Yo ya las terminé. Todas. Cristina? Sí. Okay, excellent. Uh, me finish. You finished, okay. También ya las terminé. Maria, excellent. Finish, teacher. Eh, ¿Quién acaba de decir? Oh, Jenny. Yancy, Yancy, okay. Yancy, Finish. Melanie, okay, excellent. All right. Finish to Josías, okay. Eh, para los que no lo han hecho, los voy a tratar de poner en parejas con los que ya lo hicieron para que se puedan apoyar. All right, quiero que para que sí podamos empezar el lunes en la sección 4. Ok, ready, let's go. Voy a activar para que puedan compartir su pantalla. Working pairs.
Often. Okay. Often was TV. TV after diner. After diner. Uh -huh. oh. uh, do you number two? Bueno, ahí me, me avisa cuando hay. Do you? Do you ever drink? Ever drink? Drink coffee uh -huh. in the evening. In the evening. Coffee in the evening. Uh -huh. Number three. Jeff, don't exercise very much. Doesn't. Jeff doesn't exercise very much. Jeff. Jeff doesn't. Doesn't exercise. Awesome. Jeff doesn't exercise. Very exercise. Very much. Very much. Very much. Uh -huh. Much. Gracias que me han ayudado. Okay. Y en la conversación 4.3. She's very tall. She's very tall. 4.3. Ah, solamente escucharla, nada más. De repasarla, perdón. Sí, y a hacer una conversación en la, en la actividad. Ah, sí, de la discusión. La... Ah, sí, esa ya la tengo entonces. Uh -huh. Y Cherry nos van a activar la, la del audio que está pendiente. La eh, 4.8. No lo han activado. No, no, lo intenté, pero no. Pensé que era una actualización y pensé que lo estaba haciendo mal, pero no, no es eso. Mm, ok, eh, pues yo ya lo reporté desde antier, lo reporté. Eh, um, Ahí sí se me sale de las manos. Sí. Sí, cuando entra uno dice que es un archivo que erróneo, algo así parece que me sale a mí. Okay. Bueno, eh, mm. si puede me avisa mañana para recordarme y si no lo han solventado voy a llamar, voy a llamar porque ya lo reporté con su reporte técnico y se supone que ya lo de deberían de haber arreglado, así que si, si puede, me escribe mañana en WhatsApp eh, Teacher, por favor recordar la 4.8 Listening y, y voy a llamar porque no si no han resolvido ya, ya son, ahora son dos días right? Sí, es cierto ah, archivo, archivo no existente ah, puedes, me parece ¿Puedes decir ayer o antier? ¿Cuándo fue? ¿Ayer o antier? ¿Ayer va? Um, sí, Ay. los dos días Hoy también. Quiero ver, verme. Ajá, fue ayer y antier. Ah, pues sí, ya son dos días. Y ahora sí. tres. Tres. Ya son tres, ok. Eh, uh -huh. pero, pero. ¿Y mañana tenemos clase? No, 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 no. Tomorrow no clase. Okay. Tomorrow no clase. Pero sí, lo voy a volver a reportar. Okay, guys, welcome back. Welcome back. Teacher, una pregunta. Yes. Eh, se arregló la situación de la sección 4 porque a mí todavía me falta. <laughs> de eso estábamos hablando con Nubia y Cristina. Ah, como decía mi abuelo, utualito. <laughs> 
utualito en this moment. De eso estábamos hablando. Eh, lastimosamente no, no lo han arreglado, pero uh, lo voy a volver a reportar. Si alguien mañana me puede recordar, right, en la mañana, mándeme un chat en WhatsApp. Hey, teacher, no se le olvide el 4.8, por favor. Y yo voy a llamar porque ya escribí, ya mandé el WhatsApp y se supone que ya lo habían arreglado. ¿Mande? Um, uh, ¿Será necesario que escribamos también nosotros si podemos pedir ayuda? Sí, 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 sí. Ok. Sí, eso es ¿Y a importante. quién se le tendría que escribir? A los oh. Pues se puede escribir ahí en el, en el chat del grupo, pero ahí también están los, los de soporte técnico. Está Jason, está Flor... Está Jorge, está Jorge es, todos ellos son de soporte en el, en el chat del grupo, quiero ver no sé, ahorita están como cuatro auxiliares administrativos en el chat sí Sí, Andy, Flor, Jason, todos ellos son de administración. Si se fija en el grupo del WhatsApp, los que están arriba, Andy, Flor y Jason, ellos son los de administración, los que se encargan de apoyo técnico y pues cosas así, ¿verdad? Que, que ellos tienen que arreglar eso porque ellos tienen el acceso al, al back office. Ahí está Paola también. Sí, no más. Hay cuatro auxiliares administradores. Bueno, a los que ven en el chat que están como admin, que dicen admin, está Emily. Y están cinco, cinco en el grupo. A ellos cinco les podemos escribir. Andy, Flor, Jason, Emily. Eh, Este no sé quién es. No, Paola dice aquí. Paola. Ajá. Bueno, ellos cinco son de administration. So les pueden escribir a ellos y ellos tienen que poder eh, solventar esto. O por lo menos hablar allá en la oficina y decir, hey, necesitamos arreglarle esto. Pero si alguien me hace el recordatorio en la mañana, eh, yo con mucho gusto les pongo presión por el teléfono. Any questions? No question. All right, all right. Let's go ahead. We got two minutes. We're going to go ahead and check the first one. Listening. All right, what's the answer for Lisa visited? Australia. 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 Number two, how was the weather? Bad. Okay. Okay. Yeah. okay. Okay. Peter, Peter visited Italy. 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 Yeah. How was the weather? Okay. 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 All right. All right, guys. I gotta go. I have another class, so I will see you guys tomorrow. Oh, no, no. Tomorrow, no. Tomorrow, no class. So you got off. <laughs> I, 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 can see your, I can see your face. No. <laughs> yeah, no, no, no. No class tomorrow. So you can go out. Go out, go to the movies, go to the restaurant, go shopping. Go to the beach. Go to the beach, go to the dance. Go sleep. <laughs> oh, sleep. <laughs> Okay, spend time with your babies. Yeah. Play video games, coach. Play video games. Yeah. yeah. Enjoy it. Okay, guys. See you tomorrow. Good night. Okay. Bye. Good night. See you next class. Bye -bye. Bye -bye. See you Monday. Good night. Bye.